Hey, good morning, guys. It's Guido. Supplemental coffee talk. Got my coffee. It's a Monday morning. Monday, Monday. So my re review on the uh, Turtle Mark One is out today. So check that out. No miserable Monday. I will be streaming. So there, <laughs> there will probably be some miserable Monday on the stream. But the reason I'm doing this supplemental. Hold on. I got This is a nice steaming uh, cup. Ah, it's a good French roast. Okay. The reason I'm doing this supplemental though is check this out. Where is it? There it is. Look at that thing. M60, guys. M60. Why does Guido have an M60? He's never done Clan Wars. Well, I'll tell you why. Because the Bond Shop is open. Check it out, fellas. Go to the store. Remember where you used to have the little Bond icon down there? Of course, we have to wait for it to load content. I hope the Bond store is not broken there we go the bond down here so items for bonds check it out fellas you can always get equipment directive but vehicles was empty and now it is full of tanks you can get so what do we got we got the rbfm which was a recent premium that came out so you can get that for bonds we got the 34 shielded the guard the t26 e5p which is actually the patriot version Kind of interesting that the two painted versions are in there. You get the Hydro, which is actually going to be on sale also later in the month, which is a little bit odd, but whatever. <laughs> the Mutts, which is a pretty good tier 8 medium. And then we have the FV215B. Check that out. A tier 10 FV216B. Now I have all these in my garage, which it says vehicle in the garage, so I can't get them. The M60 is now in my garage because I bought it. And the two that I do not have are the M449L for 8,000 bonds and the 121B for 15,000. So it looks like the tier 10s are 15,000, the tier 8s are 8,000. And unfortunately, I can't tell you what these are because it says in garage and gives me no information. But I don't think it was very much for the obviously lower tier thing. So check that out. You know, <laughs> Wargaming, I love you guys. I Again, I'm sort of at a loss for what how this went down you know it was described as something coming up in this last patch then they said they had an issue but there was really no information there was no information on when it would be out if there was i missed it and then all of a sudden we wake up on a monday the 20th of october and boom there's your bond shop i mean it seems like a lost opportunity for creating some hype but you know minor quibbles aside the fact is these things are here for bonds and that's really a pretty good deal uh, the the pro this is probably the best tier eight the mutts that they're offering right here. Although well no it's not true. I would say that and the T twenty six E five are probably the best two tier eights. I like the guard. It's a fun tank, but it is a kind of niche idea. This is a cool heavy. I do enjoy the FV two fifteen B. Used to be on the tech tree. Now it is not. Super Conqueror took its place. I got the M sixty because it's kind of a legend. Even though it's not really that great, I think in the meta now I got it anyway. And of course now. Now I have an actual reason to start grinding bonds, which I really didn't have in the past. The equipment is interesting, but be, I think because everyone knew this was going to happen, they saved their bonds. Um, I don't know. Go for it. The, the other tanks, the lower tiers that are good, the RBFM is a, is a really good tier 5 or 6. 5. The shield that is okay. Some people like it. And this is sort of a curiosity, the Hydro. It's a decent tank. But I, out of all of these, I think you cannot go wrong with the T26 E5 or the Mutts. To some extent, the Guard. And then these are all collector's things. This is actually a pretty good heavy as well. I did not mention the AMX M449, which also happens to have the... Well, it's not Patriot. Whatever the uh, Russian word... What was it? Liberté? Liberté. There we go. Liberty. Hence the big L on it right there. So I just wanted to let you guys know that the Bond Shop is open. Enjoy. Let me know down in the down in the comments which tanks you got or why you didn't get any tanks. My next question then for Wargaming is, hey, when do these get shifted around? When will we have another option in the Bond Shop? That's all I've got, guys. Enjoy grinding those Bonds out. I am streaming today. Should start in probably about 30 minutes, maybe less by the time I edit this and kick it out the door. See you guys later.